What is up, guys? Welcome to Tuner Cole's YouTube channel. We're finally going to use our YouTube channel. Dylan here was supposed to be uh, making a plenty of you guys watched the TCG, TCG 37 YouTube video, which was like a month ago. He said he was going to make more YouTube videos, and that's his job here, and he hasn't done it. So now we're going to do this. Anything to say? I have nothing to say. He has nothing to say. Guys, welcome to Tuner Colt's first official podcast. We actually have a special surprise for you. The TCG37 uh, GTR, the, the Rocket Bunny, I almost said Pandem, the Rocket Bunny GTR we gave away, number 37. Kyle Dempsey, he's going to be live with us on the screen right behind me. He's going to do a walk around with the car that's now in Indiana. It's in his garage. We checked in with him earlier. He's got his little fluorescent lights on because it's actually dark. It's only 6.44 p.m. here on the Pacific time, and over there, he's about three hours ahead, I believe, so he's going to do his best to film something for us. It is our first podcast, so it's okay. Hopefully, our next winner will be outside in the sunlight, and we'll get uh, more quality. Uh, I might even do Cal again. Might, might have him uh, come back on again, but anyways, Dylan. What's up, everybody? That's right. We got Kyle Dempsey coming on. That's the Millennium Jade GTR, guys. He's excited to be here with us. This um, is podcast I number one. I would like to add that that is the first Millennium Jade in Nozatech wrapped car on the streets uh, when they first dropped that color. And it was... Um, TCG number 37, like I said, the only other Millennium J GTRs uh, that were available at the time were the ones that the company, Inositech, used at SEMA uh, for their display booth because they released the color at SEMA. We actually had the wrap here at our headquarters in Tunicol Garage um, literally two weeks before the SEMA debut. That's big, guys. It's big. TC, Tunicol did it first. We did it first. Let's go. So, again, Kyle's going to be on in a minute, um, but we have a few things we want to go over. Uh, one thing, of course, is TCG number 41, our 41st giveaway. It's actually right here next to Dylan, the Nardo Gray Beast with the Lime Green Acid Green Accents. It's ending on May 14th, so make sure you guys get your entries in at tunercold.com for a chance to win this big turbo Supra. 700 horsepower, guys. I just got to say, you can't miss out on this opportunity. This car right here, I've had the pleasure of driving it for a couple of weeks. Let me just say, you'll want it. Yeah, Dylan Get loves entered. driving our giveaway cars. He's the one that uh, I see you guys' comments on our Instagram post. Um, yeah, he's the one driving it. Um, we monitor him very closely. We want to make sure he's not uh, damaging any of the vehicles. Guys, I could have made an F1 if I really wanted to. So you, you're in good hands here, okay? <laughs> <laughs> Many of you guys are probably wondering why he looks so familiar. He's the one that says every one dollar equals automatic entry. So <laughs> that's me. <laughs> so for all of our past forty-one winners, well, he's only been with us for the past five or six winners. So all of them who won love to see his face when they come down here to do uh, the claim the prize live at the Tunicle headquarters. They see his face and they're like, "Oh my God, you're the guy I saw before I entered and I won this car." So they get really excited. He's kind of like a little celebrity when the winners come down. Big celebrity, guys. Big celebrity over here. So what do you? what's your favorite giveaway car for the people watching at home? I'm, I'm just curious. My favorite giveaway car would definitely have to be the R34. I mean, it's beautiful, midnight purple, one of a kind. You can't blame me. I mean, I'm sure that's many people's dream cars. So, Well, we the first R34 GTR was given away, um, and the winner ended up a while after, okay, guys, don't go attack him on Instagram. He didn't sell the car right away. A while after, he went and put the car in a museum. So he sold the R34, but technically, he did it the right way, in my opinion, because he actually put the car in a museum in his hometown. Um, you know, some of our winners, not all of the winners, but some of our winners, you know, they, they need, they have families. They want to they wanna buy a home. They want to do this thing. So he had the car for about a year, I think pretty much a year and then he ended up uh putting the car in a museum in his hometown if you go on our instagram past winners page you could find him and look it up forget the name of the museum uh that the car is at but you can actually go see the r34 it's sitting there in the museum pretty cool i think we might make a trip sometime and go see it right yeah i mean we, we do want to go see all of our past winners the second r34 uh the winner took the supra remember the I think it was 1,800 horsepower. Was it 1,800 horsepower it was, Supra? It was a lot. It was, <laughs> it was scary. <laughs> That's Michael, by the way. He's joining us on our podcast. He's running the whole show from behind the scenes. Give him a little, a little cheer. A little applause. Uh. 
<laughs> you can't use the. <laughs> I forgot which one it was. Use the laughing one. Oh man, this guy. He's this is his first time, guys. This is his first time he's he's on here. But anyways, the second R34 we gave away that one. The winner chose the 1800 or 2000 horsepower uh, purple Supra. I remember we were doing the double purple cars. Um, the R it was the Supra and the R34 at the same time. He chose the Supra, and uh, I still see videos of him on Instagram ripping it. His name is Ninos Lecho from Danville, Illinois. I actually see him right here on our winter wall. He still loves that car. That thing was totally chromed out. That thing was insane. It was scary. Intimidating. Definitely. Did you ever drive that car? I never did. No, nope, but I've heard stories of Michael talking about it. And Oh, Michael was driving. I drove it. What did you think about the, the scariest car I've ever been in? Really? Yeah. yeah. I tried to drive it once. You, know? <laughs> you, you couldn't do it. No. It, it has like a racing throttle body. Like you touch the throttle one millis millis centimeter, and the thing just jumps. Yeah, it was it ridiculous. Just, it just to go. Yeah. But that's it. Then the then that's that's our second R34. Then the third time the, the winner took, we did a third we did a third uh, R34 giveaway. The winner took uh, two hundred thousand dollars in cash. I can't see the TV's blocking it, just to be sure. But I believe it was a two hundred thousand dollars cash or an R34 GTR, and he took the two hundred thousand dollars cash. That one really upset a lot of people, to be honest. Do we know what he did with all that cash? He actually told us when he was here it's on our video oh you weren't here that was before your time so he ended up uh he had a bit actually you know what now that i think about it i might be wrong but he had a he actually had like a, a medical history a medical condition and and uh, he lost a lot of work he owns his own business i forget exactly what he does i believe he did air air conditioning repair company i think he bought a new truck or yeah trailer. exactly yeah. so when he took the two hundred thousand dollars cash he uh covered some of his losses for his medical expenses and then he actually bought a additional truck so that they can have like a multi-truck uh ac repair company so there's not just nice. one truck going around so life-changing anyways that's mainly the the main reason why you know we do this is change lives well mo can i ask you what your favorite giveaway car was uh my favorite has to be probably the r34s as well i mean it's, it's an easy pick so guys if you have any opinions for us on the podcast, leave a comment below. Let us know what you want to see. We're going to get some guests on here, some local car fam. Uh, also, maybe even get some of our past winners. Fly them down here to Orange County, California to join us and talk about the cars. But for now, we'll get one of our winners up here, like I said earlier, onto the big screen. And, um, you know, another thing I really want to talk about is the fake Instagram pages. There's a lot of fake Instagram pages using Tunicles logos. Yeah, guys, you got to be wary of that. You do not want to get scammed. Yeah, it's very dangerous. So they're hitting up people saying, you know, you want a prize, pay us $500 fee to claim the prize, guys. We will never, ever message you on social media to pay any fees or anything to claim a prize. All of our winners will get contacted by the sweepstakes company, and you will not have to pay anything until you, uh, in, in general, you don't pay anything, actually. No, we don't ask you for any payments. And guys, it's all in the details. Tuner Cult, T-U-N-E-R-C-U-L-T, -E our only Instagram page. A lot yeah. of these other pages try to pull little tricks, so make sure you look at that username. Only one page. Tuner Cult spelled backwards, upside down, with numbers after it, misspelled. You got to be very careful because when they DM you, all you see is the logo and you assume it's us. If you go to our website, you'll see that uh, no winner will ever have to uh, pay any any money to claim a prize. Uh, when the winner is contacted on one of our sweepstakes, they get flown out. They get the cash. They get the car. Everything's legit. They never have to pay a dime to claim a prize. Remember that one time we had people, they drove from out of state? Yeah, I felt really bad. Yeah. One of our, one of our giveaways, I forgot which one it was. Was it the R34? I think it wasn't one of the R34. Yeah, ones. we showed up. Uh, we showed up here at our headquarters on a day when the winner was flying down. It was a Saturday, and there was a, a a car here from out of state. I think it was pretty far away too. Do you remember what the state was on the plate? I don't remember. I think it was. It was far. It was Idaho far. or something. Yeah, it was. We had some guys here waiting from Idaho. You don't know about this, and uh, basically they were here and they said we're we're the winners. We won the car. We're here to we're here to get the car. And, uh, yeah, definitely wasn't them. So they got pretty much scammed into driving all the way down here by one of these fake pages. And I think they paid whoever 
was yeah, scamming them. I they think paid they paid like them a fee. Some money. Yeah. Yeah. They paid something. Yeah. Um, we post on our Instagram all the time. Watch out for the fake pages and all that. A lot of people don't see our posts on stories because, you know, the way the Instagram algorithm is, it's pretty uh, tough to get the message out. Uh, another reason why we're doing these podcasts is because we can answer you guys' questions. On here, it's hard to um, post uh, a picture with some text under it and get our message out. Definitely. And guys, we're so excited. This is our first podcast. So again, like like Mo said, if you have anything, any ideas, anything you guys want to see, I mean, we enjoy this process. We want to do it for a long time. So leave it down below in the comment section. It's gonna be it's gonna be actually really cool. Um, getting some of the cars here in the backdrop, we could talk. <laughs> no, leave it in. Leave it in. Serious. <laughs> It's going to be really cool to get some of our uh, giveaway cars up on here on YouTube. And I don't want to just do only the podcast stuff. I want to do actual YouTube videos. A lot of our fans that are probably going to be commenting on this want to see a walk around video of the car. It's like we, 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 we do it for a few giveaways. We have the walk around videos and we stop then we do it again. We got to get more consistent on that. I apologize, guys. We're super busy here at Tuner Colt. Uh, we're just a three man team. Um, I know there's other people who have like 11 people running their media. We're just a three man team. We run this company very, uh, uh, small circle style, I guess, family, you know, we don't, we don't just hire people every day left and right to run operations here. We keep it all very petite as they say. Absolutely. The smaller, the better. <laughs> <laughs> no, but just guys, like this guy right here, the smaller, the better. <laughs> all right, here we go. We're whipping out the jokes. All right. But no, but seriously, we should get some walk around videos of each giveaway card at the very least. And then also we have some build videos in the plans. I so. love how he's saying we should start doing this, even though on the last YouTube video, he was one saying, I'm here to start doing this, and he hasn't done anything. This Guys, is the start. As of recent, I've taken up more responsibility here at Tuner Colts, so we're going to start pumping out more videos for you. Ain't that right, Basically, Mo? he's going to stop going to the gym 11 times a day. It'll only go eight times so that way he can help us out here with the YouTube video. I'm flattered. Go 11. ahead. Keep going. I'll take that. I'll take 11 <laughs> times a day. That's All a right. compliment. So should we get Kyle Dempsey on the line uh, before he, you know, what is it, like 9 p.m. Eastern right now? He's going to get kind of late. Yeah, it's getting late. It's like 10 p.m. So let's Let's jump on. on. We're going to add Kyle Dempsey in. He's TCG number 37 winner up on this wall. The Millennium Jade Rocket Bunny GTR plus $40,000 cash. Congratulations once again. We're going to get him alive on here. He's going to walk around and show us his car. I mean, I haven't even seen it since uh, today was the first time I seen it right before we went live, making sure we're testing the video. Yeah. Uh, I haven't seen that car in a while. It left a very long time ago. Indiana. Can be Indiana. Yo, there he is. what's Woo. up, Kyle? Do the clap. Do the clap. Round of applause to Kyle, everybody. Hey! hey. 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 Topper, topper, topper. Kyle! <laughs> What's up, guys? What's up, guys? What's up? It's dark. <laughs> it's late as hell. Yeah, what time is it over there in Indiana? It's like, what, 930-ish? Oh, that's not that late. That's not bad. That's not that bad. That's not bad. What is the car at? Is the car that's in the... Are you the car's off? here. Oh, there we go. Yeah. We got a little. Oh. Hold on. Do the clap. Do the clap. We got the dramatic <laughs> reveal. Can we get an applause? Yeah, there it buddy. is. There it is. Oh, what? We got double Both cars. cars. Yeah, I love okay. seeing that GTR. I love that thing so much. So, Kyle, we're going to be. This is our first video. Like we told you earlier today when we we're testing the video, this is our very first podcast on YouTube, Tuner Cool TV. Welcome and congratulations on being selected as our very first uh, winner of being on the podcast. Let's see this car, man. For the people watching at home, we want to look at the car again. We miss see? it. Look, look at that light scheme. That light scheme oh, is man. so dope. Oh, you got so all good. the lights on. You got that thing prepped up for us. Yeah, he's got it all ready for yes. us. <laughs> <laughs> well, I mean, I've been showing it off all over the city. I don't know if you've seen any of the videos, man. People have been recording me all over this place. Have you? Have you taken? I, mean, the... I can't go anywhere where people aren't just taking pictures of this beautiful thing. Have you taken the car to any car meets in Indiana? Car shows? Anything like that? That people can? Uh, are you planning on taking it anywhere where people watching on YouTube that live in Indiana can come and see the TCG thirty seven GTR? Of course, uh, I did take it downtown one uh, weekend, and uh, they actually people crowded around the car so quickly that they shut down the entire circle downtown. Oh wow! Within about twenty minutes of us getting there. Oh wow! Which was you know pretty insane. That's cool. Um, it, it's a showstopper. Um, gets lots of attention, lots of pictures, 
lots of people pulling up to me just saying that they love it. I think my favorite thing, super, Kyle, is super. that you were able to fit that wide body GTR into your garage. Yo, I was impressed. You should have seen. I had to drive <laughs> it off the the, uh, the trailer. That's why I couldn't record the whole thing. That's why I, you got like a 15 <laughs> second clip of me just showing it up on the trailer. He had to have me hop on there and drive it off. It was insane. I have a question. The people who are surrounding you when you, like you said, you pulled up to a parking lot or a car meet and then people started surrounding the car and shut down the spot. I'm wondering, are they Tunicle fans or do you think, were any of them, did, they, did any of them know the car from, from seeing it online during the giveaway or did, um, did they just like the car in general? Do you have any idea on that? Down, downtown, I think there was one professional photographer. He came up and he circled the entire car and took a whole lot of detailed photos. He wanted to get really deep into it and he was all taking all kinds of different angles. Um, I gave him my IG. I'm hoping he sends me some of them or at least his contact so I can buy some because it was a really good shoot. Um, some people knew a lot of people I told about, you know, I just, you know, oh, there God, was God, another God. guy there. He had a uh, Porsche GTR uh, uh, three GT3, and uh, yeah. we were cruising around downtown like all night. It was a fantastic evening. But when they shut down, um, uh, he was telling everybody about the whole winning. I was pulling out the phone, showing the app. So wow, it was, it was a cool. pretty cool, pretty cool event. Well, we then really I, uh, took it to work down in Greenwood, uh -huh. and somebody took a whole video and posted it just in the parking oh, lot. Oh no, I've seen that. He knew where, where it came from. Oh yeah, we got tagged on Tuner Colt's Instagram page. There was a guy. He said, uh, "While driving down in Indiana, you spot things like this." And then he he did like a whole walk around video on his reel, and he tagged Tuner Colt. I saw that. All right, well. Thank you for joining us. Is there anything you want to add for anybody who's watching from home that's trying to enter for this beautiful Pandem Supra right next to me and Dylan here on the couch at Tunicle headquarters? It can happen for anybody. I mean, and dreams do come true. I, I never expected to win this thing, but um, it's changed my life. What did you uh, buy so, to enter? People probably always want to ask us, what did, what did, what did the winners um, buy? Can you explain for the people watching? I bought um, the white tees. I bought a pack of white tees, and I bought a uh, pack of black T-shirts. This is one of them. The long body. And I also bought the um, detail kit, which I've been cleaning this car with. Nice. <laughs> nice 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 well sorry that it took so long to get you on our podcast it's I, like again we definitely want to get you you know because he was nice enough to go on our first one last minute we definitely got to get him on our second one but during the day so he could pull that beautiful millennium jgtr outside on the driveway and we can yes. get some nice bright sunny shots of the car yeah, absolutely nice we definitely have to so and also kyle i just want to say man it was such a pleasure to have you down here at the warehouse and to uh be here for that special moment of yours. I mean, that's why we do what we do here at Tuner Colt. We give away these cars. Is for moments like this, you know, giving these cars away and seeing that look on your face. I mean, it says it all in the happiness that you Man, still have amazing. to this day. It's amazing. What you guys are doing is amazing. Keep changing lives. Keep buying the merch. I mean, <laughs> why not? Why not, Why not, baby? There we go, Kyle. That's the motto right there. Why not? <laughs> Why not? The next time you make a video, you should say every one dollar is an automatic entry. Why not? <laughs> every dollar is a one. Put, put on a shirt. Put it on a shirt. <laughs> Why not? Why not, For baby? Real. That's Why what not? it needs to be. You need to sell one that says that. <laughs> yes, sir. <laughs> <laughs> well, thank you for being on our very first podcast. We really, really appreciate it. Cue the clap. Cue the clap. Thank you, Kyle. All right. Yes, sir. Well, well, take it easy, guys. Take, take it easy, energy. brother. Yes, sir. All right. Thank you, Kyle, for joining us. Again, guys, this is our very first time. There's going to be little glitches and stuff. I don't know how much of the stuff Michael's going to cut out. Hopefully, most of it he's going to cut out. So it looks like a nice smooth, <laughs> like we did a great job. But really, uh, it's, it's a learning curve here. Thank you, Dylan, Absolutely. for taking the time to be here, uh, as well as uh, letting us use your your program here and, and record everything. Of course. And I, and I hope the audio, everything is good. I hope my voice sounds real good too. You know what I'm saying? <laughs> Get into the wind, baby. <laughs> you guys got to make me sound good. You got to make me like, you know, you got to make me like, hey. That's how I sound. Welcome to tunacult.com. <laughs> Purchase your shirts. So, guys, I mean, come on. This is our first podcast. If you guys are enjoying it again, let us know in the comments below. Leave a like on the video. But just imagine 
100 podcasts down the line, we're going to have a pretty decent setup. Going. 100 podcasts oh, yeah. down the line. 100 podcasts. 100 podcasts down the line. Gonna we're going to have this whole thing AI generated. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> we won't even be won't here. Be, yeah, yeah, we, we won't, be won't even be here. <laughs> yeah. So, guys, make sure you guys get entered for the Tunicle 41 giveaway. 41 giveaways. That's crazy every time I think about it. So much money in cars. Giveaway ends on the 14th. It's Cinco de Mayo right now. But by the time we edit this and post it, it'll probably be only like five days left before this car ends. So um, if you want to win Dylan's favorite Supra, it's very rare we give away Supras like these that have aftermarket big turbo upgrades. So this one is a pretty fast one. It's very, very loud. We can see more photos if you want. Yeah, why don't you scroll up so our our viewers can. uh, Look at that. She's a beauty. I mean, come on. There's all the mods right there. That's a pure turbo, right? Can you come back down a little bit? Yeah, let's go back down. So we got the pure turbo 800 kit. That's the name of there the pure go. turbo right 800 here. kit. Cold air intake, all the good old boltons, Panda wide body. Sure. And those tech right. Nardo with acid green custom wheels and brake caliper combo. One of my favorites. Leave a comment if that's one of your famous favorites as well. We did a Street Hunter Supra in the past. Which was won by TCG number 28, Raymond Rivas from Linden, New Jersey. He won the last Nardo and Acid Green Super, but it was a Street Hunter wide body. And it actually didn't have the bigger Pure 800 Turbo. Nope. This is a Pandem wide body. And it has a little bit of a different mod setup with the Pure 800 Big Turbo kit. So it's pretty fast. There's a good photo of the wheels right there. Yeah, I love those it's a beautiful accident, and guys. I think something that should not be overlooked is that airlift suspension. I mean, until you're riding in it, you don't understand how <laughs> practical it is. If you like your car is dropped, if you like it slammed, listen. When you approach all these curves, these divots in the road, you get worried. But with airlift, press of a button, even on the app, boom. We only let Dylan drive the airlift cars because we want to ensure he doesn't damage the lip. So that's that's why he loves them so much. That's exactly why I love it, guys. It's easy. User friendly. <laughs> oh, he looks a little upset, maybe. <laughs> User friendly, guys. Yeah. But in all seriousness, guys, this car, it's, I, you know, I almost thought about leaving Tunicle so I could enter. I don't know if it worked that way. Nope. Too nope. late. Too late. I Once can't get it. I anyone, can't win it. Anyone who is a family member, anyone who is a friend, anyone who uh, works here especially is disqualified. All righty, guys. Thank you for watching the Tunicle podcast number one. Thank you so much. And we're so happy to have you. Thank you, Dylan, for joining us. Thank you, Michael, behind the scenes, playing with all the gizmo. The gizmos. Your job might be replaced by AI soon. You never know. But <laughs> for the time being, you're here. Um, we have a lot of things planned out. Please leave some comments, answer some of the questions we had in this podcast. For those of you guys watching this entire video, I don't know how long it's going to be. And uh, thank you. Thank you for yeah, joining us. Wait. Also, for all these who watched it to this point, all the way, the whole entirety of this video, comment, happy Cinco de Mayo. Then we'll know who the real ones oh, are. Oh, yeah. We'll know that's good. That's good. who the real See? ones are. This guy, you know, he's a YouTuber. He knows how to do all this, this fancy and stuff. And then also, shout out to everyone who is watching, because without the Tuner Cult fans, Tuner Cult would not be a thing. So we love you guys. And uh, we got more content coming. So yes, be ready. Yes, more content, please. We need more content. Our cars are so sick and no one barely sees them. So we need more content, photos, Let's videos, go. podcasts, etc. YouTube, that's his job. Make sure you leave the comment, the happy Cinco de Mayo on the on so we know you watch to the very end. That's gonna be at least <laughs> what would you say, Michael? At least twenty plus minutes? Oh yeah. That's Easily. a long I mean, if I'm going to watch something for 20 plus minutes, then I must love what I'm watching. Yeah. So again, those people watching to the end, thank you so much. And I hope you're the next Tuner Coat giveaway winner and you're going to be sitting here uh, with us. And um, karma's good, you know. I'm going to say this also. If you are have watched all the way to this point and you do comment Cinco de Mayo in the next podcast, we're going to shout one of you guys out. We're okay. going to shout all of you. We're going to shout one of you. Comment. It's not well. like we got a million subscribers. We're going to shout no. out every, all okay. three of them. Okay, dude. We'll <laughs> shout out all, all of you. three of you. So that for podcast two, it's going to be hard to decide who we shout out. No, we're going to shout out everybody on this giant screen right here. We're going to do it, baby. He said it. He's the boss. Let's all go. All right. So and uh, hopefully uh, one day when you're down here claiming one of 42, 43, 41, 44 giveaway, we'll pull up your comment and we'll make a big joke about how it's crazy that you're watching our podcast and now you're here. So keep the karma going. Good karma. Fingers crossed. That's all you can do. It's Good all chance. Karma. And guys, guess what? Listen, if you think about entering for TCG 41, as Kyle Dempsey says, the great Kyle Dempsey, why not? Why not? Why That's not? That's it. Ended there. Why not? Thanks, guys. 
That's it. We out. Where's the mouth? <coughs> That's a damn finish right there. That's a slam dunk.